Well then. Oh, we're Okay guys, welcome back to Mass Effect 3. Yay! Yay! Let's see, after we're going back to the Citadel. Oh, uh, what we did last? We just got Garrus and we just got, we saved Jack and her students from that school. So, uh, and we talked to everybody on the ship. So we're going back to the Citadel to return some missions to people. Yeah, yeah, and Ariel's in there too. I think we gotta mess with her. Oh yeah, Aura, and I think it was um, not Melissa. What's her damn name? Melissa. <laughs> Melina. No, Mar no, no. Uh, Miranda. Oh. Yeah, Miranda. There we go. The girl who likes to wear sexy outfits. Come on, Sex. She has a sexy body, so she's gonna show it off. Her assets. Her assets. No matter what she does. Be bitch. Is there nothing over here? Oh yeah, we got done with that mission, so I can actually scan again. Rico. What? I couldn't get that one because the rivers came too fast. Oh yeah, now get the rest of them. Thank you, Tate. Fly like an angel. Can you say? got a shipment of armor delivered to the Normandy. It's from a group of alliance soldiers who used to be stationed at the wrong islands. Don't know how they found it. They found they left a note just saying you need this more than we do. Oh fuck. The armor is called Rick um oh, Recon or Armor. Knight. I mean Recon or Knight or something. Uh, yeah that's from um uh, what's that game called Ray. Yeah I probably let's play that too. But I did on my old channel but I didn't get to the parts. Commander, don't call my commander. I need gas. <laughs> I need gas. the gas. Whoop whoop. Here we go. Go back all the way over here. Our sense you are so not fabulous. So outrageous. Outrageous. Where I go, level fifty. Let's see. So we're not getting Jerk. Uh, what's call yet? Fuck. Oh, it's right there. Faster than light jump success. Fuck. Okay. Evasion successful. Get it! Oh my god, it's scary, it's scary, it's scary. He's right there. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Reapers eluded. Okay, where's this little one at? Three, you oh, there he is. Yeah, I'll be a wreck now. I could play it again, too. I didn't they beat got, it they got, they got different types of women you can use. That's part of the reason why I like it so much. Yeah, they keep saying that was supposed to be the game that was supposed to be uh, Fable 3. I told, told Ray to play it because it doesn't matter if you, you could be anything. You could be like a mage, uh, you know, everything. You gotta worry about that. You can switch it all. You can actually switch. Okay, uh, where is the. Okay, it's 100%. Everything's 100%. 100. 100. Or should I get the Prothean? No, we gotta see that. You go there. You gotta worry about a cutscene or something. Uh, what? If anything happens, we go there. Where the comp. Uh, the, wait a minute. That place was there is a boat, right? I mean, it's like a ship, right? Do you want to get to the Prothean before we go back to Cynodale? Sure. Gotta uh, see if I got any. Let me save just in case of uh, some cutscene. Cause in what? Citadel? No, that's 
Princess of Pound. Princess of Pound. Fifty dollar bill. Fifty dollar bill. Fifty dollar bill. Nothing scan here. Okay, I think I got everything. I'm gonna go to the the coaster where the Prozian's at and see if there's anything to scan before I go there. Cause I feel like where you at? I'm at the. I'm going to the Prothean. Okay. But first, I'm gonna scan scan the other stuff first before we go get them. So we go get our troll, you guys. We gotta get our troll Prothean. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Found you one? found something. I found something. Good thing, good thing we go in there. There's more stuff when you get the yeah. Prothean. Remains of a Reaper Destroyer. Excuse me. Oh, shit. Too. Thank God we're doing this mission so I can go back there and get it. We have that time the other day. Oh fuck! Shit! Shit! Oh yes, make sure you take different species with you. Faster than light. Yeah, that's what my main goal was. Now talk to our organs. Aha! Uh -huh. Go here for the bitches! That was beautiful, bitches! <laughs> oh my gosh, that part. <laughs> I wish he said bitches right we laughed so freaking oh, hard. Who <laughs> heard voice act that was very it was it perfect. How she shook and everything. <laughs> the way they got her mom was hands down. Evasion successful. What's over here? What's over here? <laughs> Don't play around with the reapers. Reapers eluded. Ooh. Faster than light jump successful. Uh, yeah, yeah. Damn it. Evasion successful. Woo! <laughs> Woo! I'm feeling bitches. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Be brave, Bree. Be brave. I got everything that was over there. Oh, whatever. I kept sneaking over there. Sneaking, I mean. Well, they're too close to the part, part I was at. Signal confirmed. Oh, beauty queen bitches! Beauty queen bitches! <laughs> God damn it, Southpaw! I need to watch everything from the very beginning. I got the Prothean data files. Yeah. I forgot. Let's, see. Let's go get our trolls, Rita. Yeah. Fly like an angel. Fly right into the future. That's my favorite elf logo. What really look, that look like a pregnant suit for her or something? Some people forgot what Rush was. I like Rush was a racing car game. Well, Nintendo 64. And the Nintendo 64. Oh, sure, it disconnected from Xbox Live. Really? Really? Oh, beauty queen, bitches!
Confirm. I already did Shepard on the Mormonity. <laughs> <Boom. laughs> <laughs> the heck? Do not fly. You do not fly in my laboratory. Your laboratory? Laboratory. Shut up. He's drunk. <laughs> This is where it all began. I like a badass Power Ranger. Where the Prothean beacon gave you the vision that warned oh, you got us that about too. the I got that too. And where well, Sarah launched his first major attack with the Geth. Yes. And now, with Cerberus here, Eden Prime's colonists are under attack again. Seems like more than just three years ago. I remember the reports. I was busting my ass trying to find evidence against Sarah. Hearing that he'd attacked a colony while I sat mired in bureaucracy, that's a bad <laughs> day. Sometimes I find it hard to believe you were ever at CSEC. I wanted to help me. Fortunately, you showed me how to use the direct. Yes, I'm a bad influence. Cerberus hit Eden Prime hard. Whatever they found here was worth a major offensive. There are survivors elsewhere on the colony, but they killed everyone near the dig site. They deserve better. I know. The Alliance did what it could to evacuate colonists, but Cerberus came in so quickly. If we find survivors, we'll do what we can. What about this artifact? Is it part of the Prothean device we found on Mars? The Alliance didn't get any specifics about what Cerberus has uncovered. But whatever it is, it's better off with us than with Cerberus. I'm bringing you in as close to the dig site as I can. No way we'll avoid detection. Like damn should have a powerhouse power ranger. Understood. <laughs> All right, everyone. Oh, God. We need to move. One thing I kept was the regular color. We can get to the dig site before Cerberus seven. knows we're here. Well, I color everything else green and black. Hmm. I went back to red, too, then. Everything else looks red. It's... Whee! Let's go! Move out! No sign of survivors. Mm -hmm. Come on, we need to find the switch our weapons. It's what a beautiful colony once. It survives here. It can survive this. The city on Earth where I grew up was hard and dirty. You can see it as a war zone. Even Prime doesn't deserve this. Nobody does. Don't say on my room, bitches! I like how we go in here and just steal in freaking uh, credits. That's the fun thing about us. Hey, we did that with Pokemon. We just checked everything. Busting people's houses. I'm glad that some people caught on to that in the, the development team. What? Uh, you don't bust into my room or my house. Conley's. Wow, really? How? I can get this intel to Eden Prime's resistance. Maybe it'll help them fight back against Cerberus. Okay, yes, I'm back in right quick. <coughs> See, that's what happens. You lose your stuff when you get signed out of Xbox Live. This is why well, I'm hating whatever is causing whatever it's doing to Charter right now. Well, if you, if you have for Xbox Live, it does something? Oh, no, it's not that. Oh, come on. 
Oh, uh, I can just play without it. <laughs> Would be paleontology. Are you kidding I'm an archaeologist. Me? I study artifacts left by sapien species. The two fields are completely different. Oh, you were joking. A bit, but at least you're catching on these days. So, <laughs> you were joking. No, I was doing this. Yeah, I didn't sign back on. It's telling me that I can't connect to Xbox no, Live. No, it's not that. It's I can. Uh, it'll sign me out my profile that my game is on. What? What are you supposed to mean? My, uh, it will sign me out completely. Yeah, look, you sign me in without well, answering that stupid question, Xbox. So, hey, we don't get to ask you that question. Hello. But I'm a dumbass security question. You know it's going to sign me out. Bam, bam. Oh, since so you push B, it looks like, oh, we gotta sign you the whole time out. Oh, even though you put your password and your email in there, we're still gonna sign you out. Because we have difficult times with something. Yeah, you gotta fuck off. <laughs> Roller coaster! Hello! Roller coaster! Woo 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 roller coaster. Hello. This boy man. Roller coaster. Woo woo woo. I want it. I want it. I roller coaster, baby, baby. Oh man, we gotta watch music again. The ship was a fire, 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 that's why I didn't believe the ending of Mass Effect 3. So I was like, yeah, I don't believe you, the other sons of bitches. I mean, to me, when they did the endings the first time, basically, I think they wanted us to think about what happened afterwards. Make up your own occlusion of the ending. That's what I thought. Okay, we're coming out. But I think since people didn't like it like that, or probably they didn't really I think about what they probably was thinking about, that's probably that's why they didn't like it so much. Whoa, that's blowing me down. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, now I see the. Man, I really wish they deep even dig digger so we can see how great it looks. Dick side. Oh my goodness. Oh my it's a dick side. Is it at the dick side? Click the button. Goddess, that doesn't seem possible. It's not a Prothean artifact. It's a Prothean. Like the collectors. Or those bodies we found back on Ilos. Like the bodies we found back on Ilos. But this one is alive. You're right. That doesn't sound possible. You saw Prothean stasis chambers in the archives on Ilos. The only reason those failed was a lack of power. Cerberus found this in an underground bunker. It still has power. He's been in stasis for the past 50,000 years. Waiting for us. Think of what we could learn. What can you tell me about the Protheans? The people? Not the technology. Given your experience with the Prothean Cipher, you probably know as much about them as I do. The Prothean Empire spanned the known galaxy. They uplifted countless other species to help them join the galactic community. Galactic community? You think they had something like a yeah. council? <laughs> yes, exactly. Oh, I care Their cultural listening. and artistic expression are actually quite close to those of the ancient Asari. And given their similar interests in helping other species, it's clear that they believed in interfaith <laughs> cooperation. 
<laughs> all right, yeah, if everybody knows Javik, he's gonna explain to her something else. The way you describe them, they sound a lot like the Asari. I'm certain I'm coloring their culture with my own perceptions. Whatever the Protheans were, finding one alive represents an incredible opportunity. Good thing we brought our Prothean expert. I hope I can help. If this single Prothean was sent into stasis, he could be the foremost scientist of his time, or perhaps the wisest counselor. <sighs> Cerberus damaged the life pod when they excavated it. The life signs are unstable. Well, let's get him out of there. No, breaking open the pod would kill him. We have to find the command signal that ends the stasis mode. We also need to figure out how to physically oh, open the pod without doing more damage. Fuck so you, Xbox! To yeah, that's what I said too. What they found at the dig site. That's likely our best bet. Oh shit! Uh oh. I like how. <laughs> how dramatic Shepard was when they came. Yeah, drop down, bitch. Mm -hmm. I hurt your punk ass. The way she screamed, though. Yeah, there you are. Yeah, I suck, Samaras. Boy, I said their name. Stop right. bunker. Get moving. Come back. She said, "Coral." Got the nicest view. They look at over like the biggest like. Shit. <laughs> shit. Oh shit. Far for that dude. Here. Hello there, fine guy. How's your day? I let him bust in front of you, bitch. <laughs> hmm, nice. Seeing all this dev here is bothering me. What you got wounded? You're playing with me. Fuckers? There. Get down. Yeah, you fell off the cliff. That's what you get. Hmm. Wow. They were gunned down while having drinks Damn, and watching what the game. To you. This isn't a military stronghold, it's somebody's home. We didn't kill these people, and we're going to shut down the bastards who did. That must have sucked though. You like, yeah, then you get shot, 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 shot. Open sesame, bitch. Man, damn, you didn't even help him, assholes. I wanna be, I wanna be like Mike. Pow! <laughs> Nobody did. Part one, please. Your eyes turn blue. I found footage of the Protheans. 
Cerberus is studying it to figure out how to physically open the pod. Oh, what? Oh, your ribs? Like you got red eyes. See, release. More intel to help the colonists. Of course, that one gets shot because he. And everything is possible. This intel will give Eden Prime's resistance movement a real chance to push Cerberus out of their colony. Oh, that was all? Okay. Go back to that pod. Push forward, double time, double time now. Sounds so heavy, just run over there. I can't see your eyes. Oh my. Man, we get to see what it looked like. I really wanted to see what it looked like in color without all the destruction going on. Can't see, I can't see Sharice's eyes. people's I've got the signal you understood that you didn't no all I saw was static Cerberus was trying to make sense of it without success the Prothean cipher you received on Pharos it lets you see the images as a Prothean would and understand their language whatever it does I saw the video and the signal they used. Perfect. Then we just need to figure out how to physically open the pod. Let's go back out. Thanks, this bitch. Open sesame now. Come on, I'm not Aladdin. Come on. Yeah, you got to Be scared of us. We're just trying to help you. So we have to worry about the others trying to get us? Okay. Because we already killed them. Woo! Yeah, 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 yeah. Damn, just to see one of them get hit by one of those. Yo, 
Is that a little service thing you're supposed to find? He said, bang! <laughs> he like... Oh, Kamehameha! He did. <laughs> There's supposed to be like three of those little service things you're supposed to find for this Victory. guy. I think it's only two. Because I think the third part is when you had to help the communists. Yeah. On those little uh, computer thingies. And they kind of look like an insect's clothing, but they, he kind of looks like a shark too. How many have we lost? Reaper forces have destroyed approximately 300,000 life bonds. Yes, but you know, servers won't make it easy for us, will they? My eyes look so cool when I'm looking at this. So, basically, what what was going on? I just had my head, I just had, um, during a conversation, I just turned off my, I just, uh, my helmet was off. Oh. Well, actually, everybody's helmet was off. That's what I did. Yeah, often conversation. Well, don't get to see mine. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you die trying to place that sucker? To the next galaxy, bitch. I mean, galaxy, bitch. Whoa. Crash those things. We're up here already. Up the ceiling. Attract the birds. I gotta find another way to bitch ass niggas. Those bitch ass niggas. We're a trailblazer anyway. We're awesome. We're <laughs> a trailblazer. <laughs> Transmitting the signal. Heavy Cerberus force is inbound. Looks like we've got a I bet. Here they come. Whoops. 
wasted that. Oh, damn it! I keep forgetting to wait. Are you in there, sir? Yes, eat my bullets. Second to catch our breath. If anybody needs fresh clips or a bathroom break, now's the time. Has the life pod ended stasis mode? I saw some flying I can lay down a singularity to block enemy access. <laughs> fresh clips on a bathroom break. Yeah. Fuck you, ho. Let's get to the pot, girlfriend. some time to fully regain consciousness. The news is you fired him for being your son. <laughs> well, Shepard should have now realized that when he would wake up, they probably burst out of nowhere. <laughs> Careful, he's confused. They're woken up from long ass sleep. Remember, it's been 50,000 years for us, but for him, it's only been a few minutes. No, the bunker is falling. There is no other option. There are pods online. Those soldiers are still alive. Their sacrifice will be honored in the coming empire. I always get hurt. I always get this whole bunk of it. Dan Garrett's out of it.
clarify. Sensors are damaged. Automated reactivation is not an option. We will remain in stasis until a new culture discovers this bunker. This may lead to a power shortage. Do not shut off more pods. I need the few that are left. Power needs will be triaged appropriately. <laughs> How many others? Just you. <clears throat> you can understand me? Yes. Now that I've read your physiology, your nervous system, not to understand your language. So you were reading me while I was seeing. Our last moments. Our failure. Your people did everything they could. They never give up. And I could use some of that commitment now. Shepard, whatever you did got Cerberus interested. Asari. Human. Terrian. <laughs> I'm surrounded by primitives. It's not safe here. Will you join us? You fight the Reapers? Yes. Then we will see. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> a living Provia. That's correct, Admiral. But he's not quite what we expected. Commander, our scientists barely understand what they need to do here. If the Prothean can help us construct this device, we need his cooperation. Understood, Admiral. We're losing colonies faster than we can evacuate. We've never seen a force like the Reapers. He has, Admiral. Can he help us? Mm -hmm. I intend to find out. Good. Cerberus slipped up and gave us a new weapon. Don't let it go to waste. Hack it out. Hack it out. Shepard, I need you down in the port cargo hold. It's about our new guest. I'm on my way. I didn't do anything. The most dangerous goes into this room. <laughs> What's the problem? I've tried to make the room more accommodating, but they're not letting me talk to him. Apologies, Doctor. Contact protocol with a new species. Assume hostility. We had to dust off the regulations. But he's not new. I've spent my life studying Protheans. At ease. I don't think our guest will be a problem. Will he? That depends on you. <laughs> I can sense fear in you. Anxiety and distress. The Reapers are willing. What do you mean, you sense? All life provides clues for those who can read them. It is in your cells, your DNA. Experience is a biological marker. Then what exactly did I experience back on Eden Prime? That was a hell of a flashback. The battle that its own mark on me. I communicated this to you. It can work both ways. Like your beacons? Yes. Again. You found one. You saw it all. Our destruction. Our warnings. Why weren't they heated? Why didn't you prepare for the Reapers, human? It's Commander. And nobody could understand your warnings. The beacon nearly killed me. <sighs> then communication is still primitive in this cycle. We pieced together what we could and used it to stop a Reaper invasion three years ago. Then the extinction was delayed. Now we have your plans for the device. We're going to build it. Device? The weapon your people were working on. I'd hoped you could tell us how to finish it. We never 
finished it. It was too late. Then I take it you don't know anything about the Catalyst. No. No. I was a soldier, not a scientist. Skilled in one art. Killing. What was your mission? Among my people, there were avatars of many traits. Bravery, strength, cunning. A single exemplar for each. Which are you? The embodiment of vengeance. I am the anger of a dead people. Demanding blood be spilled for the blood we lost. Only when the last Reaper has been destroyed will my purpose be fulfilled. No other reason to exist. Those who share my purpose become allies. Those who do not become casualties. Then I'd say you found an ally. The goal of this ship is to wipe the Reapers from existence. But how far are you willing to go to achieve that goal? I do not believe you, Commander. Lying is a biological marker. There is doubt behind your words. We found this at the dig site. I assume it belongs to you. It is a memory shard. Could it help us with the device? No, it contains only pain. But I will help you fight. And the last thing the Reapers hear before they die will be the last voice of the Protheans, sending them to their grave. If you don't mind, I have a few more questions uh -oh. I'd like to ask. <laughs> Here it comes. I've written over a dozen studies on your species. I've published in several journals that... Amusing. Asari have finally mastered writing. I'm sorry? Never mind. What do you wish to know? We've never seen a species with this sensory ability you have. It was common among my people. Imparting experience through touch. The chemistry of life. Complicated ideas could be absorbed in seconds. That sounds very useful. We evolved as hunters. Reading a thousand details in our environment ensured our survival. Beginning to understand the beacons a bit more. Later, we developed technology to harness our ability. Information could be stored in certain objects through touch. Memory has its own <laughs> biomarker, its own chemistry, as do knowledge and skills. The beacons could remember these things. Things like Reaper invasions. Yes, I can still sense the turmoil in you. Witnessing the extinction of our empire. The fabric of your being was forever marked that day. So, could you read something about this room? There was liquid, a form of incubation. The DNA of a Krogan who lived here. He was powerful, prone to violence. I'm impressed. His name was Grunt. And if he were my enemy, I would have given him a wide berth. There is great strength in his genes. Liara here would never forgive me if I didn't ask you. What was Prothean civilization like? Yes, I've always wondered. What sort of government did you have? And can you tell me about your religious beliefs, or perhaps the... We are dead now. What does it matter? I'm sorry. Studying your history has been a lifelong passion of mine. When I was born, Empire was already at war with the Reapers. The first thing I remember was seeing my planet on fire. What was your civilization like before the Reaper attack? We were the dominant race of our cycle. We ruled the galaxy. My studies indicated you were the only race engaged in space travel at the time. I always found that curious. We were one empire composed of many subjects. All eventually called themselves Protheans. What if they didn't want to? They uh -huh. weren't given a choice. Are you saying you enslaved the other species? Any could oppose us if they wished. And if they had won, they would have won. Many tried. None succeeded. I had no idea Protheans were so... severe. It was by necessity. 
very early we encountered the dangers posed by machine intelligence. They rebelled against us. We've had the same problem. They're called Geth. We could not allow the machines to surpass us. It was decided the only way to win was to unite all organic life within our empire. Did it work? For a time. The Metacom War. We were turning the tide. Until the Reapers arrived. Then we understood machines had surpassed us long ago. In ways we could never imagine. Back on Eden Prime, it looked like there were other stasis pods. What happened? The Empire had fallen. And we knew our cycle was lost. We were the final vanguard. The best soldiers left alive. So more of you were supposed to survive into this cycle? Yes. Under my leadership, a new Protean Empire would have arisen. We would have commanded the races of your time to prepare for the next Reaper invasion. But traitors within our ranks, indoctrinated agents, betrayed us, and the Reapers discovered our plan. Just out of curiosity, how would you have commanded us? By leaving you no other option. You would have joined our army. Or face the Reapers alone. We've uncovered quite a few Protean ruins. Were you observing our ancestors? Before the war, we cultivated species who showed potential. Eventually, you would have been offered a choice to join the Empire. But when the Reapers attacked, we ceased all study. We hoped they would see you as too primitive to harvest. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Is there anything more you can tell us about this device your people were trying to build? We heard only stories. They said our scientists were constructing a great machine that had the power to defeat the Reapers. You never saw it? By that point, the Empire was smashed into pieces. None of us knew what the others were doing. Well, if we don't finish it soon, the same will be true of us. What can you tell us about your own war with the Reapers? Many of the details were lost. The conflict lasted for centuries. Those that faced the Reapers in the beginning were long dead when I was born. There were memory shards, however, passed down from soldier to soldier. They gave us fragments of what happened. Several years ago, we found a Prothean VI that called itself Vigil on the planet Ilos. He was the caretaker of a research project. During my life, Ilos was only a rumor. It was said we had cities there, built on the ruins of a civilization before us. The inner sun. If our scientists did have a research facility, whatever they were doing was secret. Yes, Vigil said they wiped all traces of themselves from the records. That's it the now! Them. The scientists eventually went into cryogenic stasis. More of my people survived. You don't know it, But they did stop the Reapers from yeah, taking control of the Citadel in this cycle. They delayed their invasion. I never saw the Citadel. It was captured long before I was born. How did your people wage war against the Reapers? Attrition. We fought them system by system, planet by planet, city by city. Entire worlds were sacrificed just to slow the Reapers down. Time they spent harvesting a population was time we could regroup. It must have cost you a long run. Yes. Our own people will be indoctrinated, converted, and turned against us. But there was no choice. Mercy is not a weapon. It is a weakness. Why do you think your own cycle lost the war? What had been our strength, our empire, became a liability. All races conformed to one doctrine, one strategy. The Reapers exploited this. Once they found our weaknesses, we could not adapt. The subservient races became divided and confused. Then, it was only a matter of time. I'm happy to say our cycle is different. Most races cooperate, but uh, they still remain unique. Nice. Then it may be your only hope. Thank you for talking with me. You're welcome. I never imagined actually Burper. meeting a Prothean. The bat. This has been amusing. Oh? To discover the most primitive races of my time now rule the galaxy. The Asari, the humans, the Turians. There's also the Solarians. The lizard people evolved? I believe they're amphibian. <laughs> it flies. Commander, you may count on me. I am known as Javik. 
And welcome aboard the Normandy, Javik. <laughs> He's an easy flight. He's just smiling. <laughs> 